That right there is a familiar sight and sound this time of the year in Oshkosh. Airplanes are filling the sky in that area as we are just a few days away from EAA's Air Venture. The event, in fact, starts on Monday, but before it does, there is a lot of work to get done. Yeah, Packers fans park on grass, and so do a lot of airplane pilots. <laughs> Let me tell you, Fox 11's Alex Onalo at Whitman Field today showing us tonight what it takes to get the aviation event off the ground. Airplanes are being parked, flowers are being planted, and fences are being built. Crews are working round the clock so Air Venture can take off. Down to the point where there's a million little things to get done and you're trying to get them all done, but our volunteers are coming in, airplanes are coming in, campers are coming in. There's a lot to prepare for. One attraction in particular is getting a lot of attention. Our own one week wonder building an airplane in a week, watching that project take shape. A crew of volunteers will work to build the plane inside this box with help from anyone who stops by starting Monday morning. I want everybody that walks through that front gate to consider the idea that they could build their own aircraft. The goal is to taxi the plane by next Sunday, so volunteers are making sure everything is ready now. All that stuff, tools, everything has to be ready so that we can have, you know, 25, 30 people going nonstop starting Monday morning. But work is going on all over the grounds. Vendors are setting up displays, taking care of the tiniest details. We've done a lot of landscaping, as you can see. We moved in a lot of rocks. Uh, with the landscapers. It's going to be tiring. I don't anticipate a lot of downtime during the day. But worth it. The excitement of the event, we know it's something bigger than any one of us. And again, you run on adrenaline for a week as we kid each other, we'll sleep in August. In Oshkosh, Alex Ranallo, Fox 11 News. More than 500,000 people are expected to attend the seven-day event.